don't see anything out of the ordinary. Nor do I. Does the floor give way? Sir, don't give it any ideas. <clears throat> Oi! Oh! Nothing. George, give me a hand. Oh, sir, it's no use. It's stuck. There must be some mechanism by which to open them. This is telephone. I'll call someone. Oh, uh, sir, that might not be a good idea. Oh, that's no good. Oh, no. When's the baby coming? Oh, bloody hell, Watts. They wanted to keep it a secret. How could they do that when everyone clearly knows what's going on here? I only found it in my glass. I found nothing in William's glass but milk. Impossible. I definitely felt I'd been sedated. You want to have a look at this? What is it? Goldie Huckabee had you followed by a private investigator for the past few weeks. It's damning evidence, Murdoch. Circumstantial at best. Did you break into their garden shed? Of course not. I, I tried the door, but it was locked. I wanted my lawnmower back. It's the Empress Hotel. Talk to the night clerk. See if anyone else saw. We should also try to determine who the real killer might be. Who the victim is? What did he do? He was a businessman, I believe. Follow the money. Crabtree, dig into Mr. Thompson's business dealings. I will. So what are you standing around for? I believe we're supposed to be at the rehearsal dinner. What time is it? Bloody hell! Here they are. Mrs. Brackery? Constable, where have you been? She's been driving me crazy. You're lucky I was able to get the mail when I did. <clears throat> well, Mr. Fellows, seems you can come and go from my home with ease. And look at that. You found the elusive springs. Almost as if you knew exactly where to look. Planning to move them somewhere more likely to be discovered, were you? I must thank Miss Cherry for her help. You needn't all be so smug. I could just say you set me up. Oh, it's clear who set all of this up, Mr. Fellows. Wilderness, somewhere north of Toronto, I suppose. By the sun, late afternoon. I suppose the Pendrick Symposium will be over by now. Yes. You never got to give your speech. No. Well, sir, give it to us now. Oh, I, I don't know. <laughs> you have a captive audience. <laughs> well, all right. The future is unknowable. <laughs> Good work, George. What do I do now? Uh, just stay put. We'll alert you if anyone approaches. Watts, where are you? Uh, at the Midway, Inspector. Uh, I can see Stratford. He's uh, at the top of a ladder, taking down a banner. Good. Tell us if he moves. Hmm. Sir, do you think that's the killer? It's not Stratford. 
Well, sir, it's not Mr. Stratford, but it could be someone working with him. So is that him? It's not Stratford. No, but is it the killer? We don't know, George. Should we stop him? Wait. Oh, he's just a passerby.